Hi, I'm Tasman Ropley, cosmetic chemist and trainer here at the Institute of Personal Care Science. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make a freeze instant look anti-wrinkle serum. Now let me show you how to put it together. Okay, so to start my serum today, I'm gonna to be using um, obviously some water and to this, I'm gonna be adding my humectant. So I'm just using some glycerin here, just a small input. Now, just remember with glycerin, you don't wanna use over 5% in a leave-on product as this can feel quite sticky or tacky, which uh, will be undesirable to a lot of consumers. And I'm just going to give that one a stir until homogenous. Now, to build my serum, I'm going to be using some Sepi Maxen here by Sepic. This is one of my favorite polymers. This creates really nice, stable, robust uh, gels and even helps with emulsions as well. Now, this will not hydrate straight away. Sometimes it can take a whole day or even overnight. So this will need to be, um, first you need to stir it and to wet the polymer and disperse it. And then we need to cover it and leave it um, sit for some time for it to fully hydrate. Okay, and here's what my Sepi Max Zen looks like when it's all hydrated. As you can see, it's um, turned into a really nice gel. Nice and clear as well. Okay, so just going in with my active here. So my star active here is the Xantheline by Give a Dan. Now this is the instant uh, Botox-like active. So this is a natural active, it has Botox-like efficacy and also skin sensitivity uh, modulation benefits. It's good for reversing skin aging effects, it combats wrinkles, it calms and soothes skin and scalp discomfort. Uh, it also provides immediate relief, mimics Botox properties and provides well aging benefits. So it has some really good uh, quick data to go with it. And it's also EcoCert and Cosmos approved. So that's what we're going to be using today for our freeze instant look anti-wrinkle. Now to this I'm just going to be adding a bit of jojoba oil. This is just gonna help disperse my active a little bit better if I add it into my water face. And I'm just adding a bit of jojoba oil. This is a really nice balancing oil. So it's good for, for dry and also oily skin. Now the active does have a bit of a plant odor. Um, so I will be adding an essential oil to this later. Okay, so next I'm gonna be adding is some allantoin. This is a good uh, anti-irritant, soothing, anti-inflammatory type of ingredient. I'm also gonna be adding some aloe vera extract. This is also good for soothing, calming, hydrating. And my next active I also am gonna be using is the Hydraeus, but also by Givoden. So this is a three-in-one active to rehydrate, restructure, and repair the skin. So this is really good for, um, for anti-aging skincare. I'm gonna be going in with my preservative here. Some tocopherol. This also has some really good skin benefits as well. It um, helps protect the skin from oxidation, also the formula. Um, so it helps with free radical damage, which is cell damage from, you know, it can be from environmental factors. And I'm also just gonna go in with a little bit of um, essential oil here. Give that one a stir. So something important to note when we age is we tend to lose a lot of elasticity in our skin. We also tend to lose a lot of hydration and moisture as well. So it's a good idea and concept to add some moisture or some hydration um, points into your formulas to help recuperate the loss as we age. Now lastly, I'm just gonna check and adjust my final pH. And I'm just gonna cover and leave this sit until the next day, just to check for any signs of instability. Okay, and here is what my serum is looking like the next day. It hasn't lost any viscosity there, which is really good, and it's nice and stable. There's no separation or any oils or anything sitting on top, which is always a good sign.
It's got a really nice light feel to it. It's not sticky, not tacky. And it's got a little bit of emolliency too, but nothing heavy, nothing greasy. It doesn't feel like uh, there's actually anything on my skin right now, which is always nice. Well, there you go. That's how super easy it is to make a freeze instant anti-wrinkle serum. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave any questions in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to receive notification on the rest of our videos. Happy formulating.